So I was confused and I was like, I don't understand how we're at the end of, of March and there hasn't been a new release yet, right? So I realized from looking at Build-A-Bear's Instagram comments that the new Hello friends, welcome to my channel. My name is Janie. On this channel, I do a little bit of Build-A-Bear videos, Squishmallows, occasionally some lounge fly, and hair care and skincare reviews. Today we're talking about Build-A-Bear once again. Last week I talked about the Love Pup from their vault collection, and this is February's pick. This is Blossom Bunny. She's super cute. So it's Build-A-Bear's 25 year anniversary, so they're re-releasing older designs from their vault, and this was February's pick. So she was originally released back in 2010, and she's out absolutely beautiful she's just a bunny full of flowers and I really love her floppy ears I love the pink side underneath it I think she's a little bit softer than the love pup which is right there if you missed that video I will link it in the cards as well as down in the description box along with a playlist of all the stuffed animal videos that I have done so far but she's absolutely adorable I really really liked her so I picked her up at the American Dream Mall in New Jersey my friends took me there it was a blast it was amazing it was beautiful and slightly overwhelming so I went into their Build-A-Bear just to see what they had and I knew ahead of time that I was probably going to pick up Blossom Bunny and once I grabbed her I went to get her stuffed so we waited in line it was a little bit busy because it was like a Saturday afternoon but once we got to the stuffing machine the associate asked me if I wanted any sounds or smells which I said no to originally I was going to try out a scent but I needed to stick to my budget I've been spending like crazy and like I said before although I love stuffed animals I do want to do it in a way that is okay for my wallet so i skipped on the sense and the sounds and i went just for like a basic heart instead of like the beating heart it's like six bucks i do like the beating heart and i'm pretty sure i have a couple stuffed animals that have the beating heart you squeeze it and you feel it like pulsating but um that wasn't necessary for me like unless i'm really hugging an animal that like really often the beating heart doesn't make sense for me so i didn't do the heart ceremony i just made a wish and i stuck it into each of the bears and blossom bunny is just adorable she's so cute and i feel like she looks really nice without any clothing but while i was waiting in line to get checked out i did see some shirts so this is very touristy of me but I couldn't resist. There was an American Dream shirt. It's blue with a little bear on a roller coaster, and I bought it. It reminds me a lot of what I used to work at the 34th Street one in Manhattan. We would get a lot of people that would buy like New York ones or like the Statue of Liberty outfit because you know you're a tourist and you want something to remember this visit by. So I chose this one. This is $10, and we're gonna put it on her. Of course, the colors kind of clash with her overall print, but I didn't really care because it's just a little, it's actually a hoodie. It does have a hood. But um, I don't really care because it's just, you know, a casual little outfit for my bear. And honestly, I never made a video about this, but I have a lot of clothing for my bears. Because originally, when I started going to build a bear, this was like three or four years ago, um, consistently, I wanted to have a bear in my background at all times that I can dress up in different outfits for every video or pertaining to the holiday or the season we were in. Sorry, there's an airplane flying by. But for whatever reason, I didn't keep up with that. So I was just left with a bunch of clothes and costumes and stuff like that so I definitely want to make a video about that and kind of go hunting for all the clothes that I have so that we can really see and maybe actually start putting them on my bears because it's just been sitting there for like over three years now um, but anyway back to the bear she's adorable she's cute on her left paw she has the 25th celebration collection in like silvery sparkly metallic font and then she also has the 25th years of heart and hugs um, this is a little tag, which my other one didn't have, um, but the little bear, I mean the little puppy, it didn't have that, but it's fine, it's cute, I don't care. Um, but yeah, she's adorable, so we're gonna put on the hoodie. This was $10, I thought it was $6, but it's 10 and they also had a different one from American Dream, like, it was a two-piece set with, like, a tutu, and I have a feeling it was probably, like, 15 bucks, so I skipped out on that, and I just chose the hoodie. Luckily, um most clothes fit on most bears but sometimes you do find that it's not compatible with certain features like wings or just really thick stuffed animals um but let me see i'm going to put it on her and yeah i'm really excited okay so in my other video i was confused and i was like i don't understand how we're at the end of of march and there hasn't been a new release yet right so i realized from looking at build a bear's instagram comments that the new bear gets released on the 25th of every month so 
that that's why because I am we're still on 20 at the time that I'm filming this video it's gonna be on Friday that they announced the new bear so I'm super excited about that I'm kind of hoping it's not that cute so I'm not drawn to buying it but we'll see anyway this is the hoodie it fits her perfectly it's just the hoodie part that um kind of gets in the way with her floppy ears but nevertheless she looks cute now I can remember my trip forever that was my first time being in Jersey since I was like 19 years old when I was graduating from high school and I wanted to go to Rutgers University so that was a long time ago and then we also went to a Walmart that's a whole other story and I did buy some squishmallows there Walmart is the place for the squishmallows and it sucks that I have none locally but I went one to Jersey and the first that's the first time I've been to Walmart since I was 16 years old so that was trippy on its own I love Target but I feel like Walmart just has things that Target like Walmart has lines that Target does not and it's very frustrating <laughs> but yes here is blossom bunny in all her glory she looks adorable and i kind of wish her eyes were just a little bit bigger because sometimes when i'm looking at the pattern i get confused as to why her eyes are so small but she's perfect nonetheless i love her i think she's a perfect collector's item especially if you didn't catch her in 2010 which i definitely didn't i was not paying attention to build a bear much except for like their my little pony collection and like their pokemon stuff back in the day i mean they still have pokemon stuff but i don't know either way she cute i like her um if you have any requests for things you'd like to see if you've picked up any of the vault collection ones let me know i would love to hear what your experience has been with them she's still available currently online she is 25 dollars with my other one she, this one was sold out the love pup but i did find it locally like i said or like in stores so that doesn't hurt to check around even if it's not spoken about on their website not spoken about stated on their website it doesn't hurt to kind of check and see so so that being said definitely check out my playlist with all my other stuffed animal videos because i do a lot of squishmallow and just a lot of cuteness in general i have a lounge fly video coming up that i'm very excited about i bought a bunch of dumbo bags i'm probably gonna post a sneak peek on instagram once they arrive they still haven't yet i feel like hot topic and box lunch their their shipping has been very slow lately but i don't mind because i like to forget about it and then be pleasantly surprised once it arrives but yeah if you made it to the end of this video thank you so much for watching don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you very very soon with another video bye